Okay, so he mentioned about a founders group in Peking University that the person developed the source code for basically typing the Chinese character. So what this has done, but this has been seized by Chinese intelligence uh, bureau. And then they basically put a backdoor in all the apps you can find in the world if the apps is allowed you to type Chinese even though you don't have to, okay, you don't have to type, but if they allow you the ability to type Chinese characteristics, that means they could have potentially be compromised by the Chinese Communist Party and its military, okay? So that means WeChat is just one out of probably thousands, if not millions, apps out there that would enable the Chinese Communist Parties to surveil in your cell phone. OK, but again, I don't want to scare everybody, but because not everybody is going to be on the CCP's radar because they have a resources capacity, too, although they have a lot of people. Right. You heard Miles Kuo mentioning about thousands, hundreds of thousands of people in Shisan Mountain. Shisan Mountain is in Beijing and near the area, the military area where the nuclear uh, facilities, underground facility was, was as well. OK, so Miles Kuo told us that. So they have also hundreds of thousands of people there to monitor U.S. cell phones. But not everybody will be on that radar until you give them a reason or you are in a position that they believe that you can help them.